Well, I know what a strong box is. It's just a storage. Uh, it's just a, a, a form of box, basically. It's, it's a it's a chest. I think it. You sometimes you get them at the start of um, um, hard cube, hardcore maps like this. It's only to store things in. That's not very exciting. A cache, apparently, according to Wiggy, will store ten thousand ten thousand items of a single type. Yeah, well, I thought that as well. Thoroughly useless. So we'll go with the portable tracks. Mm -hmm. Which at least are quite good because we can do things, for example, when I was pumping out stuff, I was thinking of storage stuff, I could, you know, it'd be quite good to pump like honey or something into a new user at a later date. So let's uh, put those in that are going to brave the rain, I'm afraid. There we go. Stick them in there for now. Now, what am I going to do? Are you enjoying watching me making random stuff, by the way? <laughs> Oh, stuff I'm just making and not actually doing anything with. Oh, advanced. What's this? Elec oh, well, Electrum's good because we already made some Electrum, didn't we? How do you make Invar? There's actually. In well, I can know how to make Invar. There's actually an Invar drone. Uh, do I want to make Invar drones? Should we look at how to make them and see if they're actually easy or not? I don't want to do use my genetics material on making these things as random bees. Nickel and ferrous. We haven't got a nickel drone yet, have we? Hold on. Hold on a second. Doesn't ferrous also produce nickel? I thought it did. Oh, shut up about the damn thingy. Uh, common and industrious gives us... Oh no, what am I talking about? Sorry, no. I'm thinking of some of the ores. Ferric ore is what I'm thinking of. Ferrous is simply the, the name for the bee that makes... Um, Nickel drone comes from not stupid Britannia stuff. Oh, this is getting complicated now. The esoteric one, which comes from go away, cultivated plus eldritch. Well, we can make that. I might even have one of those actually. I don't know. It seems like a bit of a pain, doesn't it? Really? This because this is this is the advanced frame that requires electron info essentially. So let's do something. Let's do something. I'm not in the mood for complicating B stuff right now. I'm just going to do some simpler stuff. Like this. <laughs> it's a block of iron. I think I could make one of those. Having iron, you're able to start with some applied energetic system. Goody. That's well I was just thinking this morning, I was just thinking, you know what I'd like to do today? Some applied energetics stuff. Have I got any iron in here lying around? Iron bars. And some iron nuggets. Let's make a block of iron. I've got to submit this. Oh I've actually already got enough, haven't I? Look. There we go. Let's turn these over as well, why not? Good oh. Good oh. Let's ha have to hand this in. Hand up, uh, just give you my block of iron. Here you go. I guess I haven't seen something for it. Inscribe a calculation press, an engineering press, and a silicon press, and a logic press. Oh, I guess I'm going to get a computer out of it eventually. I'm get some of them, give me some of these boxes. But what do I do next? I don't actually know how to make a computer. Are you going to tell me? You will now put all of... After this point, you will now put all your chests full of bees and combs in a single block. The ME drive. Essentials. But where do I go to next after this? I think I need these things over here, don't I? I don't need Skystone. I don't know. I'm going to have to make some bees, aren't I? I think I'm going to get involved in any bees. I'm going to have to um, look some things up and make a plan, like I did before, where I had written down, you know, what bees to make next to make sure I'm doing things efficiently. So let's have a little last scan through the through the quests, and then we're going to see. I think I'll tidy up today by seeing if there's any quests that I've sort of already got finished, like these ones, for example. Before I go on, oh, we can quickly do this actually. Let's do this. I want to test something here. So, oh god, we're getting the Britannia stuff. Getting a this is the Britannic drone. This is what we were making the um, the mana pool for, and putting begonias in there to make mana. Okay. This quest is actually less pleasant than I. Than I it's not likely to go very far. I warn you now. This is not likely to be a complete quest. I'm not about to get the gene sample I want. I don't think. But we'll give it a go. 
Get a botanic drone is very easy. Get a rooted drone and put it in the mana pool. Okay. Well, that's that's the first step, and I think it's going to work. Now, if you look up, get out of the rain. If you look up the botanic drone, what I'm worried about is it says in here that you need half a mana pool, unless that's maybe a, a weak mana pool. It looks like half a mana pool, more than half a mana, to make a rooted drone into a botanic drone. Now, I haven't got half a mana pool yet. I have... Three qu a quarter? Barely a quarter. However, when I hold this over here, it's telling me I can do it. Now, it looks... that The second the image on the right looks like a botanic drone. I don't know if it is or not, but what we're going to do... Do it anyway. Did I just lose my drone? I think I did. Did it use up any of the pool? It did. But what did I get out of it? I don't think I got anything, did I? It didn't go into here. So what just happened? Did that go wrong? I did, I did think maybe that I wasn't going to get anything out of it, but that's really annoying. Maybe... Hmm, I don't know. I've had things on mana pools before now, where if you haven't got enough mana in there, some of the botanical things, you will not get what you're after. I'm a little annoyed that you used some mana up, and I didn't get anything back. I have to look that up, possibly. Apparently I didn't get anything back from that. Hmm. I didn't wonder if that was going to work or not, but I thought it was worth the risk. I just got to throw some more bees in, basically. Annoying, though. Very annoying. But anyway, the reason I was... Uh, I was also thinking it wasn't going to work, because... So what it says is... Remember how long it took me to get this much mana? Well, the mana that I had before I threw a bee in there and lost it. Um, I... It took me a long time to get, in, to get enough mana for that. And I've got to get a half a mana pool every time I get one. And the trouble is, the only way to get the Botanic Queen is to take the, the Botanic Drone you hopefully get, shove it in here, and maybe you will pull out the Botanic Aspect. But it's only maybe. Yeah, You might not get that at all there's a good chance that you will get one of the other aspects, like fertility or something else. And only if you can do that, can you then... That's the gene sample is what they want, they do the gene sample with botanic aspect. After that, can you name the queen? This is rather painful. If it was easier to get mana, it wouldn't be so bad. But it's not. It's god awful to get mana. And the only way I can think to get mana, I think, easily, is to have some sort of automated system where I've constantly got... when I'm making some of my bees are simply pumping out drones to chuck in here. I have some sort of automated system of doing that. Which is possible, but I haven't really found a good automated way of getting the drones out of here and simply pumping them straight in so I can do other things and, and get on with it. I'll have to look up some ideas on that because this is a real sticking point here and I'm pretty annoyed by it, to tell you the truth at the moment. I don't like what they've done with the mod pack. I mean with that aspect of the mod pack, because if it was just you had to do it once, that would be fine. You have to struggle to get the mana and then you do it once, but the fact you have to do it again and again to possibly get, and use up a whole bunch of these these things, which I haven't got many of, quite frankly, to get... I, I, I'm annoyed. Anyway. Um, but I thought I'd give it a go anyway, and we'll see what happens. In the meantime, I'm going to go and sleep and see if we can get... Let's see if we can finish off this last quest by getting, hopefully, the last two spider eyes that we need for the uh, for the other quest, the, the resources quest over here. This one. Well, I did some looking up on the, on the websites, and it appears that maybe my, my begonias ate my rooted drone because <laughs> they were that close. Um, which is embarrassing and irritating, but it looks like we can still possibly make another one. And again, it's not using half a mana pool like it's saying it does in the uh, thing. Let's see. 
Well, thank goodness for that. The problem is, so how much did that use? I did put some more. It used a, a chunk of matter. I did put some more in there. But we've still got low odds of pulling this out. That's part of the problem. Um, not that one. Uh, some magic. God, say it's so annoying. Okay, let's just stick it in there and see what happens, shall we? Come on. So frustrating. If this doesn't work, I'm going to be fed up. By the way, I've got some more skulls in here as well. Tolerant Flyer Force. Well, that's wonderful. Thank you, but that's exactly what I was looking for. Okay, so... <laughs> I've got some more over here. Hold on. I don't know if there's enough in the pool anymore for this, but I've got some... Uh, luckily, my rooted queen that I have, um, she has fertility too. So, uh, I've got I've got no shortage of drones. It's the mana that's the problem. The mana and the glassware. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, this could be... Uh, there's something I just keep on doing, I think, and I come back to, essentially, is the answer. But I'm annoyed that I'm going to have to mess around with the damn glassware like this. Give it to me. Because there's, 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 you know, the odds are that I could spend ages trying to get this and simply not get it. God damn it. I was hoping by saying that I might, you know, maybe <laughs> prove it one way or the other. Okay. Well, we're out of mana and we're, we're running out of glassware. So, um,. This is turned to possibly making me feel like it could be a very slow map. A very slow mod pack to do. We'll see how much this is going to restrict me, the fact that I can't do this bit yet. What's even more annoying, by the way, is that when we get past this... We now have all the petals that we want. We get the petals. Once we've got this, we can make all the other flowers, and we can make mana so easily... It was ridiculous. I could just randomly breed bees together to get the genetics that I wanted. But there we go. Um, never mind. Uh, let's before let's finish this on a high note anyway, because that's just really. I'm a little bit peeved like that. I don't. This particular part here, I feel, is is more clumsy. The fact you have to pull the thing out is far more clumsy than it needs to be. And I I almost feel like cheating, quite frankly. The fact I've got to randomly stick stuff in here to maybe get anything out, and I don't think that the the bee that I have, the, the the botanic drone, I don't think it's even got very good stats for most of it. So I'm just wasting my time and di effectively diamonds by using genetics labware to pull out all these useless flipping um, traits. You know, it's, I just find it really annoying. I don't like to cheat, but I, if it if I try it a certain number of times and it doesn't work, I think I'm going to because. I don't know. It, it just I just think it's very it's not that it's um I think it's as badly designed. But there you go. Right. Um but while we're here we can do one other thing though, because I got two spider eyes from the uh thing over here, so I think now finally we can hand in this not that one. Okay, and we might be able to do a couple of quests. Which one to claim? What do you bet in one of these is Fertility 4? Let's have a look. You gave me the same bees that I already have. Oh, there's empty ones. What? You just gave me four empty gene samples. That that That's lovely. Thank you very much. And I get to keep my spider eyes. I will treasure them always. But while we're here, let's see if we can do this one as well. Oh, I don't think we've got enough zombie. Oh, wait, we do. I bet we do now. We do. A brainy drone of the brainy princess. I don't know what these actually do. I bet this one's finished already. These frames, these proven frames in the out as well. But let's um, I'll leave them in there. Who cares? Let's go look at the stats. Mm. 
let's put all these in here, just get them in. Get them done. Get them done, there we go. Actually, were they anything special? It's a very big area. What is different here? We've got a princess. They're actually different, aren't they? Oh, our princesses don't stack. Yeah, nothing special in there, is there, really? I know I should be doing more breeding with these damn drones, but... Princes and things, but I, I don't know, it just seems so hit and miss. I just don't like the fact that I'm... I haven't got a good access to diamonds to get more. I'm, I'm, I should just maybe put some more... How many, how many diamond combs have I got over here now? This is constantly running. Six more. So I should have another diamond now. Remember I said before it was two and a half hours, I think it was, to make to make a diamond. Maybe I shouldn't worry about it so much. There we go. So I've already got some diamond fragments in here when I'm doing things off screen. Where is it? There we go, five. So I've got enough for another diamond in there. I don't know. Right, but I've, let's look at the brainy ones, though. So these... Oh, they've only got fertility one, but these guys... I think they've got a chance of making... Okay. <laughs> Zombie brain defunct. Products of furtive comb and rotten flesh. I don't want to run these guys, really. They're, they're no use whatsoever. And there's a chance of... Their combs may be fetid and foul-smelling, but their intelligence is well-developed. I'm sure it is. Um... There may be a chance of, of brainy zombies spawning, but I don't really want brainy zombies spawning. Thank you very much. I don't need them. Anyway, put them in here. Just for the breeding, I guess. Right, box is getting full again. Uh, put the brains back, and let's see what else we can do with... Maybe we can get another couple of quests completed from the monster... the monster line of things. The brains back. Uh, let's look at the book. Flesh, gunpowder. I think I've probably got some gunpowder. A batty princess. In the past, creepers were very evil, and oh, they still are, but they fear the bees. They can get the soul from everybody and give you the materials. We hope we never see a Herobrine bee. Please don't. So, what does a batty, a batty drone and princess do? I presume they produce bats. No? They give me gunpowder and furtive combs, which is the last thing I want. And I guess we might get bats spawned. It's all very interesting, but you know, it's not, <laughs> it's not very useful. <laughs> what else have we got? Any more of these useless bees in here? A snow blizz? Oh, oh, now I haven't got snowballs yet because I need to make a wintry princess, but I've certainly got lots of blitz powder. How much do I need blitz powder? Really? 32. I've probably got lots, actually, because how much do you get if you break up one of these blitz rods? Three? Two. It's not really useful for anything, is it, really? How many more do I need? One, two, three, four, five. Is that right? Why well, I'm being frugal with this useless stuff, I have no idea. Oh, Blizz, not blitz. Well, whatever. What's a blizz? Where do you get a blizz from? A blizzy drone and a blizzy princess. That's the slime one. Feathers? <laughs> Where do I get feathers from? I only have one chicken so far. Well, one official chicken. And it didn't last very long. Um, oh, well, I've got a few more bits done. There we go. There was a, not really a highlight, was it, really? I, I got some... I made some machines in this session and got some stuff done, but I don't really feel like I'm going very far at the moment. Going nowhere fast is probably the answer. But there we go. I think I need to I need to make another plan. Is what I need to do. I think. I make another plan. I need to make a plan about make what bees to make next. 
a plan about maybe I don't know trying to automate some uh, some more no I don't think I need to make any more diamond bees I don't think yeah maybe I have to automate this I don't know I need I need to make some plans I'll think about what I need to do next and then basically get on with it see what we can do but I don't want you to I don't want to become too ridiculous a let's play where nothing seems to be going on very much you know I want to keep it keep it moving forward and uh, and I'm I'm feeling at the, I'm feeling a bit all at sea at the moment I'm not really sure where to go to next and although I can see possibilities with things like you know breeding breeding bees together to get interesting aspects at the moment I'm time I don't think is it's not time that's the enemy at the moment it's still resources that's the problem I can't spend you know I can't just really nearly use up loads of mana because I haven't got very much and I'm not an efficient way of making lots more of it it's not like in regrowth where you can do that and I haven't got although I'm getting replaced resources certain key ones is quite a slow rate but there you go still sort of enjoying it anyway I hope you enjoy watching it at any rate and I'll uh, I'll say I'll make a plan and I'll bring you back and we'll see what we can do next and have some definite aims in mind see you again next time <laughs>